hello guys i'm starting this vlog really late it is now what time is it like half five it's half past five <laughs> A bit of a late start for a vlog but it is saturday and i've had a bit of a lazy saturday morning i've just finished filming a video so that should be going up tomorrow which is sunday um so you should have already seen that i finally got around to filming my beauty haul from america it's been a long time coming it definitely has but hopefully fingers crossed you should have seen it and it should have gone up if everything went to plan i just got a very exciting parcel in the post so i thought i would sit you down maybe somewhat over here and uh, show you what's inside there we go does that work am i in shot hello this feels very casual i'm praying you can't see how messy my bed and my floor is right now because it's pretty bad. So I got this in the post this morning and um, I was going to do this in a proper video but then I thought this isn't really much to talk about so I'll just pop it into a vlog and uh, did a bit of a Mac order. I definitely go through phases of liking Mac and then not really being particularly interested in it and um, I went to a Mac counter a few days ago and this was definitely a phase of interest. I really wanted to buy loads of stuff and I didn't have it in stock so I went back home and went online and bought it all on there. So it's calm, it's turned up and I thought I'd just quickly go through what I bought and show you because why not do a spontaneous MAC haul in a vlog. I went a bit mad for lip products so I got one, two, three lipsticks and two lip pencils. This is actually the reason that I went into MAC. I finally caved and decided that I wanted to get sore. I'm not quite sure why. Nudes don't particularly suit me um, but I thought I would give this a go because everybody has it and why not buy one myself. So let me know if you've used this and if you like it and um, if it's any good for you but I think this is quite a pretty colour actually. Let me swatch it for you. Look, we can do proper swatches. How cool is this? It should focus. There we go. So it's definitely a lot pinker than I thought it would be. I thought it'd be more of a dark brownish nude. Even the swatches that I looked up online, because I always do that when I'm buying stuff online, looks a bit more brown. So interesting to see how that will look on me. But I think it's quite nice. It'll be definitely very dark because I have quite pale skin. I think it will come out a lot darker than it does on some other people. Um, and then I got this one, which is boldly bare. And I wanted this one because it looked like a nice kind of pinky shade. I actually swatched, swatched this while I was in MAC um, and it looked really nice. This is a lot lighter than Saw and it's kind of more of a, it's definitely more nudey. So this one here and it looks a lot more kind of orangey toned. I'm not very good at describing nude lipsticks. Um, but I bought those two to go along with these three lipsticks or actually two of them. I feel like Velvet Teddy had its moment a while ago, the whole Kylie Jenner lip thing, which I'm not particularly into. I think she looked beautiful before the lip thing. Um, but I wanted to kind of give this a go because I swatched it in the store and it was a lot different to how I thought it would be. It's a little bit like Boldly Bare. It's kind of more of a pinky nude. Um, whereas I thought it was like quite a dark brown kind of greyish colour, which don't particularly suit me, but I think it looks really pretty. So that'll be interesting. I think it'll look nice with either Saw or Baldy Bear. So got one of those. And then I also got Mare. And this one has a really strange name. I'm not sure how you should pronounce it. If it's Mare or Mare, it just makes me feel like I'm saying Mare. But this is more of a kind of darker one. I say this is actually quite similar to Saw. Um, it's definitely more pinky. I thought I'd pick it up and give it a go. Of course, though, I couldn't just stick to these. And I did buy one bright lipstick. It's called Tropic Tonic. And look at that. I'm not sure it's going to come up quite as bright as it is in real life on camera, but it is an amazing bright coral. Looks a lot more red on there actually, but it's really, really kind of peachy corally pink. I think it's so pretty. And this is probably the one that I'm going to wear the most out of all of them, I can tell. So those are all the lip bits I bought. And then I had one more thing. I think I bought this because I wanted to get free shipping. I'd always rather buy something extra than pay for shipping because I absolutely hate doing that. Um, and this is, what's this called? It's the Studio Chromatic Pencil Crayon um, in NC15 NW20. This is basically a waterline eyeliner. It's a kind of creamy color. It's basically just a nude eyeliner. Um, now I've tried a few of these in the past and the one that I have is kind of a bit old. I've been using the Rimmel Scandalized one for ages and I really like it, but I've had it for too long now. Um, so I thought I would get a new one and this just looked like a really nice one. And these are supposed to be very pigmented and last a really long time on there. And I do find the colors on my waterline don't last particularly long. So I'm interested to see if this one will work. And I might do a proper video on these and maybe update you later if that is something you would like to see. Or I might just do a blog post in a few days time once I've tried them all. So those, all the bits that I bought from MAC. This train is now approaching its final stop. This is London Waterloo. Change here for London Underground services. Please remember to take all your personal items with you when you leave the train. Hello guys, so it is Wednesday. 
Monday. Monday. <laughs> Why did I think it was Wednesday? It's Monday. So I'm on my way to a Space NK event. I'm going to that later. Um, I'm with Susie at the moment. And we're looking around for a place to take some photos, some outfit photos, get some food. I feel like it's a bit of a common theme whenever you're around. We need food. Feed me. Feed me, please. Um, so yeah, we're gonna take some photos and get some food and then go to the Space and K event, which is actually a NARS event rather than the Space and K event. I got that completely wrong. It's the Lenny Mascara, which is really exciting. comfortable there. Yeah. <laughs> Hello guys, so it is day to day. It's Wednesday today and I'm working from Brighton today. Um, me and Susie have set up ourselves up in a little workspace which is really cool. Um, so we're getting lots done. I've just edited a bit of this vlog, realised that I haven't actually said goodbye for the last two days. It's very, very late. I'm going to bed. Um, so I hope you all have a lovely evening or morning or afternoon whenever you're actually watching this vlog. And don't forget to give it a like if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're new and I will see you all soon. Bye.